So right now I'm at uh, Werner here in Detroit and I'm walking through Clark Park here on a beautiful, beautiful Friday evening here in February. Uh, 62 degrees today. Um, it might be a, might be a record. Uh, I'm not sure, but pretty close to a record if it if it isn't. But uh, so, anyways, um, right here in Clark St Clark Street is uh, and Verner is Clark Park and uh, this is Mexican town right in here in, uh, the, in southwest Detroit um, the area in general it's not the safest neighborhood but it's, it's improved quite a bit in the past 15 20 years or so And there is a little trail through here. A little pavilion there, that's pretty cool. Feels good to get out and walk though. I mean, it's been, uh, it's always good to have a good, uh, Warm day in winter for sure. There's a YMCA there. I think that was an old hotel at one time, maybe. A lot of older buildings throughout here. And uh, actually, West Grand Boulevard is around here somewhere where there's a bunch of older buildings, older houses, I should say. And I did a video about driving through Werner in Mexican town uh, about a year ago, a little less than a year ago, but I did highlight Clark Park, but I didn't really, I haven't done the walk through yet and, you, and posted it to YouTube, uh, so we're doing that today. Um, very nice park though, it's uh, really lively in the summertime. And actually there's a little uh, hockey rink up here and I played on a beer league about uh, seven, eight years ago and we played a hockey game out here in the winter time. Great experience, with, uh, you can see the Ambassador Bridge. In fact, let me see, I don't know if you can, uh, yeah, so you can see, you can see the top of the Ambassador Bridge right there even though it looks like there's sticks there. You can see the Ambassador Bridge from here. Western International High School is right there. I don't know if that's a Detroit public school or if that's a private school or what that is. I know Southwestern High School, I've made a video about that a while back, about a year ago. And kind of featured them, them tearing it down. You do see homeless people here, you see bums, you see you even see uh, uh, an element of crime here sometimes. There are gangs in southwest Detroit, uh, much like all of Detroit really, other than like the, the developed places. But generally speaking, southwest Detroit's not that uh, unsafe to walk through. Like I'm right now at Clark Park here in Mexican Town. Uh, there's a lot of touristy uh, Mexican restaurants right on this stretch of burn right here. So, generally speaking, this isn't a, that unsafe of an environment here. Hey, a really old bathroom right there. That's pretty cool looking. For sure. So that's where some of the hockey nets are in there. Some of the old hockey nets for the rink up here. And we have some people playing tennis up here. That's neat. I didn't even know they had tennis courts up here.
And initially I was going to drive and highlight a road, you know, cruise through Detroit, you know, maybe like Livernoise or Grand River or, you know, Gratiot or whatever. John R., maybe that's a good one to, to highlight, being that it goes through all the way to the north suburbs. But I wanted to get out and walk today because it's a very nice day. And like I said, it's not supposed to be, it's not supposed to hit 60 again until further notice because you know we're still in the part of winter so a 60 degree day in mid-february and you know metro detroit you just don't see it too often so so take advantage of this warm warmer weather here on uh here on a 60 degree day it's uh I mean, you, you could pass for a summer day. I mean, there's some days in July where it's this, where it's this temperature, you know. So, but this is a really cool little tennis court here. I like that color. It's uh, very vibrant. There's some people playing tennis there, and there's some people playing soccer here, which is neat. You see, there's weightlifting here. Play a table tennis. I have a basketball court. Not a full basketball court, but they do have a basketball court. Mm -hmm. Cool Amerigrounds, I've never seen those before. Must be new age. these drinking fountains are working. I can go for a uh, little bit of water right now. But that's a really cool playscape actually. All wooden. They have like rope you can climb. So really nice park though. And there's a hotel Yorba behind there. I know there's some significance of that. And there's the before mentioned uh, hockey rink. That's the ga uh, where I played the game. You know, uh, was, I want to say it was 2015 where I played that when I played that hockey game. Really good experience. So uh, playing hockey outdoors, you just can't beat it. So, there's a baseball diamond and a, and a football field there. You can see, you can see the, uh, the goal post uprights right there. And then there's a baseball diamond here. Um, yeah, Hotel Yorba. Now you can see there's a better view of the Ambassador Bridge right there. You can see it. Uh, yeah, there's the top of it right there. So that's the Ambassador Bridge. Goes to... Windsor, Ontario, Canada, and there's the Gordie Howe Bridge, which they're working on right now. It's going to be completed here in a year or two, but, and that's Fort Drew right over there. Uh, you can see the, see the BP right there. I know it's kind of blurry, but that's Fort Street right there. So, So Clark Park is, is uh, positioned between Fort Street and Verner, as Verner and Fort Street run parallel to one another. Um, and like I said, it's, it's uh, really developed quite a bit, you know, in the uh, you know 15, 20 years or so. And yes, it still has its uh, problems uh, down here for sure, but, you know, a vibrant area though. I 
If you're ever looking good for good Mexican food though, uh, Werner, the place where I parked and be in this video, that's always a, that's a really good spot. You know, to find a, a wide variety of Mexican food. So, anyways, I'm gonna get off here now. If you like this video, um, oh Scott Scotton, that's the the road that uh, on the other side of the park. That's the road running running that way. So, anyways, we get off here now. If you like this video, well, there's a little shower here too. It's weird. I don't know why they have that, but anyways, park. Oh, there's a splash pad. All person using splash pad. So there is a uh, a splash pad here in the winter time. Yeah, in the summertime. I know you meant. I, you know that's what I meant. So. Anyways, I'm going to get off here now. If you like this video, hit that like button, subscribe, and I will see you on the next video.